Yo, what's going on YouTube and welcome back to another Xbox One video. So, somebody put out a question the other day saying, could I put together a video showing you how to stream music and videos from your PC to your Xbox One? So, um, I decided to do just that. So the first thing you want to want to do um, is you want to go onto your Xbox One and you want to go to your settings. You need to make sure you've got this option checked so that you can do the streaming. So go to preferences and then in preferences, make sure allow play to streaming is ticked. Now by default, it will be ticked, but just make sure it is. Then you want to jump back to your PC um, and now you need to make sure you add your Xbox One as a registered device so that you can play to it. So go to your control panel and then when you open up your control panel, you want to go to devices and printers. Um, and then once you're in there, you need to add it as a device. Now I already have it added, but for the sake of this, I'm going to show you how you would do it if it wasn't added. So in the top left hand corner of that page, you'll go to add a device. Now this box will then appear. And if you don't already have it added like me, the Xbox One will appear and it will be, it will be called Xbox One OS. So then you click on it and you go next, you go add, it will then install the drivers for it, install the necessary stuff, and it's now registered as a playable device. So with that in place, now all you need to do is find the media you want to stream and we can go and you know, play on Xbox One. So let's start off with music. Let's go and find a music track. And if you right click on it and you go play to, you'll see there's an option that says Xbox System OS. So you play that, this little sort of media player will appear on your PC and it'll show you what's queued. If you switch over to the Xbox, you'll see that it then launches Xbox Music um, and then give it a few seconds to sync up and then you'll find that your music will just start playing. It's as simple as that. So that is music. So let's do the same and let's jump over to video. So if I just go to my, um, my video folder um, and I just find something random, uh, there we go. Let's choose one of the Dead Rising videos I made the other day, which if you haven't seen it, go and check it out. Um, but yeah, same thing, you right click on it, you go play to Xbox System OS, and this time if you go on your Xbox One, it'll open Xbox Video. Um, same same gig, you know, just give it a second to sync up, you know, it might take a little while, but then once it's done that, the video will then start playing. And it is as simple as that. So no sort of like fancy crazy things you need to install, download or anything like that. Literally just make sure it's a registered device on your PC, make sure you've got that option ticked on your Xbox One, and then right click play to, and that's it. So hopefully you found this helpful, if you did, don't forget to hit that like button, show your support, give us a thumbs up, it does really help me out. Obviously don't forget to subscribe if you're not already, so you can stay tuned for all that awesome Xbox One content and all that next gen content just in general. Um, also don't forget to stay tuned to the Arix Gaming Facebook and Twitter page so you can get all these videos as soon as they drop and you get all the gaming news throughout the week. Um, but keep it locked to Arix Gaming for all your next gen coverage. Also um, don't forget to follow me on Xbox One now as well, my gamer tag is Arix, so that'll appear in the corner right now. Um, yeah, follow me there as well and then we can you know, hit me up with messages if you want to play or anything like that. But yeah, thanks for watching. Take it easy. Catch you next time. Peace out.